music. But I am gonna go ahead and switch over. All I have to do. Let's get this puppy rolling. So now, let's, get, let's make sure that this isn't too loud here. All right, so today what we got for you is it's a Topps Big League Baseball 2020 pack. So this is just kind of a, a fun one that I was able to find. Um, so like I said, Big League Baseball. It comes with a Topps exclusive Super 7 MLB figurine inside. So I have no clue what that figurine is going to look like or what it's going to be or anything. Um, it says that we got 10 cards per pack and five packs per box. So I think this one's just kind of more of a fun one, but who doesn't like fun, right? Let me go ahead and get this puppy open and get it rolling here. Ah, so the suspense on the action figure kind of goes away real quick because it's just sitting there right when you open it it's just sitting there and as you see the action figure that we get is none other than it is baseball superstar Aaron Judge. I'll put him down here so you can kind of see him. Look at that. Aaron Judge. Bada bing, bada boom. Pretty cool. Let's get out of that so I can see the full screen. There we go. So like I said, we've got five packs in here. Each pack's going to have ten cards in it. I have no clue what they're going to look like, what they are, or anything like that. This was just more of a fun pack. Probably just going to roll through this real quick and get some ones that we know a little bit better. So first off, we get Chris Sale. That's pretty cool. Didn't throw all this year. Big League Best runs batted in from last year. So you got Anthony Rendon, Freddie Freeman, and Pete Alonzo right there. Little horizontal view of... First baseman from Cleveland, Carlos Santana. A very short time Mariner. Albert Pujols, future Hall of Famer for sure. So that's pretty cool. Marcus Stroman, free agent this year. Supposed to be a big acquisition. Uh, rumors been swirling with the Mariners possibly. Maybe going to the other side of New York. Who knows? Nomar Mazzara, went over from the Rangers and had not that great of a year with the White Sox, but got to make playoffs, so that's pretty cool. We have an orange Paul De Jong here. Pretty cool. And then a flipping out Jorge Soler. Flipping out over the Jorge Soler. So if you're just joining us, um, I'm opening up a 2020 Big League Baseball Tops brand box. Uh, it was kind of just a fun one, a real, I guess, cheap one that they threw in with it, whatever it is. Um, so we're kind of rolling through it. Here's a Bo Bichette 2020 rookie card. Interesting. That's pretty cool. World Series champion Cody Bellinger. Ooh. Potential trade pond this offseason. Francisco Lindor. Ryan McMahon. League best strikeout leaders. You got DeGrom, Strasburg, and Scherzer. That's all from the year that the Nationals won the World Series. So not this this year, but last year. Here's a Jordan Alvarez rookie card. Looks like a variation of it. A star character production. I'm oh, sorry. Pretty cool. An orange hits leader. So what do we got? Whit Merrifield, Ralphiel Devers, 
and I believe DJ LeMayhew right there for 2019. Oh, another side one. Mike Fears, Fires, I believe. Another sideways, Christian Walker, first baseman, Diamondbacks. Doesn't get a whole lot of time because you have Paul Goldschmidt over there. Xander Bogarts, pretty solid shortstop for the Boston Red Sox. And then, like we said before, we have that rookie card, Bo Bichette, right there. So we got two packs down, and then we're going to be uh, moving on to a, a slightly more exciting break. So it's just kind of a, I guess, our warm up, so to say. Getting our warm up in. Just kind of hauling through these ones, and then we're going to get to a little bit more hits. Oh! A Vlad Guerrero. Well, Junior, of course. Goes along with that Bo Bichette. Joey Lucchesi, pitcher with the San Diego Padres. Andrew McCutcheon of the Philadelphia Phillies. It looks like Shane Bieber. I believe that's the All-Star MVP, possibly. I think he's holding up. MOB game, All-Star game MVP. I was correct. John Lester. Another flipping out, Vlad Guerrero Jr. An orange, Xander Bogarts. Miguel Cabrera, also a future Hall of Famer. Jacob deGrom. Mitch Garver. And that should be back to the front of that Vlad Guerrero. Two more packs. Run through real quick. Like I said, I don't really know much about these packs that I'm opening right now. That's why I'm kind of running through them quickly. I don't know worth, I don't know what's special, all that kind of stuff. I think that these are kind of just more, uh, I think the draw to it a little bit more is that little figurine that you get with it. Cy Young, Jacob DeGrom, Christian Yelich, Starling Marte, Charlie Morton, who has officially become a free agent but is contemplating retirement, so we'll see what happens there. Home run leaders for the National League, Pete Alonso, Eugenio Suarez, and then Cody Bellinger. Big 2019 year for him. Clayton Kershaw, finally a World Series champion. Exciting to see that. Uh, the Angels in general, it looks like. I wonder if this highlight is when uh, the combined no-no against the Mariners, of course. Mike Trout, a defensive wizard. He's the Doctor Strange of the outfield. Designated here slash pitcher Shohei Otane. And then the first baseman, Jesus Aguilar. So pretty cool cards. Some some kind of cool little variations to it. Um, there's some like did you know facts and stuff on the back that are kind of cool. A lot of their stats, at least for the last couple years. So not bad, not bad. Carlos Carrasco. He got the Roberto Clemente Award. He was the one I think that came back from cancer. Tommy Edmond. Sin Chu Chu. The Mariners killer himself right there. Nick Sinzel. He's been kind of a sensation over there for Cincinnati. Walks leaders. You got Alex Bregman, Mike Trout, of course, and Carlos Santana. I'd like to see how many of those are intentional walks too. Roll call. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. I think that's the third Vladdy card that we've gotten. That's crazy. Harold Ramirez with the Miami Marlins. I like those sleeveless jerseys. Those are pretty cool. Miguel Sano with the Twins. Nico Horner. He's a second baseman. Rookie card right here for him. And then Hunter Renfro. So like I said, this is kind of more of a fun pack. But it was it was there were some pretty cool little little pieces in there. Some of them have bent corners already. That's crazy. So let's put those off to the side. And uh, which one do I want to go with? Let's go with these. Let's break out the Bowmans. Okay, so I've got a Bowman Mega Pack here. I've got four 10 card packs of Bowman baseballs, and it says plus two exclusive five card chrome packs. Okay, so I'm going to have four normal packs in here of 10 cards, and then I've got two exclusive five card packs. So that's 10 chromes. That I am guaranteed. Like we said, this is a 2020 pack. So this would be the cards for this season. So we'll see what all we can kind of pull out of here. Um, 
a Beau Bichette rookie card would probably probably be pretty nice to grab out of here. Um, I don't know if they have. Looks like they possibly have prospects because I've got a Wander Franco card back here, the number one prospect. Kempe Rays shortstop. So that could be an interesting find. Um, but pretty much any time that you can grab some some rookie cards, it's always really interesting. So it looks like these are going to be our exclusive Chrome cards. I kind of feel. Okay. So we're going to put those off to the side. And like I said, I've got oh, four. I've got four normal packs of 10 cards. So that's going to be 40 cards for us fast math people. Ooh, I happened to look at the back card, which I try not to do, but I did see a Mariners logo. It's always fun. AJ Pook, rookie card. That's nice to grab right off the bat. A Bobby Bradley, another rookie card. You can tell that it's a rookie card right up here. That RC stands for rookie card. Grayson Rodriguez. Reese Hines. Oh, I can see a different, you guys see that different side with me? It means I've got something special coming up here. Owen Miller. It's not very big names yet. We got a Chrome Zach Brown. No, we're not talking about the singer. Oh, look at that, back to back crown, Chromes. A Joe Ryan, first Bowman. So I'm not sure if that's saying that that's his first card in general, like ever in the Bowman set, but if that is the case, that's pretty cool. Um, I know Zach Brown threw decently this year. Um, definitely, I would say pitching, especially starting pitching, is not the absolute strong suit of the Milwaukee Brewers, but that's okay. Joe Ryan with the first edition. He went nine and four. Nice. I did not hear his name very much this year with the word Rays, but it is a Chrome card, so we'll package it up real quick. Travis Dimitri, Dimitrite, John Means, and there was the Mariner logo that we saw. Daniel Vogelback, who is not with the Mariners anymore. I believe he's with the Blue Jays now. Was with the Brewers. And I think they kept him for like a week after we cut him. So, I could have called that. Oh, all right. Another future Hall of Famer, Miguel Cabrera right there off the start. Ooh, I see another, I see another different siding back there. It looks like another Chrome card. Eddie Rosario. Twins made a good little push this year. Freitas Nova, that's a prospect right there. I'm almost positive that's somebody in the minor league system. Yep, minor league stats. With the Houston Astros, that's pretty cool. Bryce Turong. O'Neill Cruz, that's a top prospect with the Pittsburgh Pirates. I know that because I get him on the show every once in a while. Here comes a Chrome card right here. Travis Swaggerty. Wonder if he's related to Sam Haggerty, the Swaggerty. And then we get a JJ Blade. Kind of interesting. That that logo isn't super blurry on your screen. Like that's how it actually looks to me right now, too. Interesting. Ooh, and a Bryce Harper card. Never can go wrong with Bryce Harper. And then Hunter Dozier. The bold Dozier. It looks like I'm probably going to get two chromes out of every pack, so I'm just going to go ahead and set these chromes off to the side for right now. I will pack them up later, sleeve them up later. I believe Bowman is a, is a huge push on prospects and minor league people, so... Rookie cards and prospects, grabbing like a an Adley Rutschman or something right here, a Chrome would be would be pretty sweet. Kevin Newman, ah, there's that rookie card that we were talking about. There's a Beau Bichette rookie. I'm actually gonna go ahead and put that with the Chromes, even though it's the basic card of it. It's still, a, that's a good little rookie pull right there. 
Jonathan India. Rocking the double ear coverage. Luis Gill. Ethan Hankins. And a Bryson Stott. Our Bowman Chromes for this pack that I just busted open. Trevor Story. Big hitting shortstop out of Colorado. And then Javi Baez. Another big hitting shortstop right to follow. Big fan of Javi Baez. El Nino. All right, so this is our last normal pack. Oh, yes, sir. Definitely the card that we wanted to see. I wish it was in a chrome, but Kyle Lewis got to love this kid. He's going to be huge for us. Him, Julio, and Kelnick in the outfield for years to come is going to be so beautiful to see. Matthew Boyd, another pretty solid year with the Tigers. Jose Barrios, Miguel Amaya. Bobby Dalbeck. Ah, there's the Wander Franco card that we were talking about. Number one overall prospect in the systems. There's Jonathan India again. We talked about him a little bit earlier. There's the Chrome version of him. Ooh, Royce Lewis. That's a top 10 prospect right there too. I watched him when I went to the Fall League down in Arizona last year. Real exciting player to watch. Willie Calhoun, and then Zach Gallen, who had a huge year for the Diamondbacks this year. I didn't realize he was a rookie, actually. I thought this was his sophomore year, but obviously I was wrong. Okay, so now we're moving on to these chromes. So each one of these packs is going to have five of those chrome cards. So the two that are in the middle of each one of the last packs, each one of these packs is going to have five to it. Um, the chromes just look cool in general, like that little that shimmer to them, that, that holographic kind of look is pretty sweet. So uh, I'm going to run through these real quick. Not too quick, but we've got Miguel Vargas that says that's a first Bowman up there for him. Evison Herrera. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, this is a special chrome right here. Abraham Toro, rookie of the year favorite. He did not, not produce that, but that's okay. Antonio Cabello and Aaron Ashby. It's cool to get that rookie of the year favorite though. He didn't even end in the top three. Um, he definitely got some time playing this year, but wasn't a huge force. So here's our last pack. We're gonna bust this one open, um, and then I said we'll be back. I've got a couple more to break open. I've got I think two more baseball ones and I basketball ones so we'll be back at a later time to look through those ones so let's see what we can grab here first before we get going john diaz i'm pretty sure these are probably all gonna be gerard encarnacion i watched this kid at the fall league too and he hit a ball that if you've ever been to um the let's see i was in the sat like saddle saddle something fields to the right of peoria and he hit a ball up and over the the hill that's in left field there it was just absolutely crushed but anyways oh here we go people andres munoz this is actually the pitcher that we picked up in the trade with san diego uh, he throws triple digits he didn't throw for us when he came over because he just had tommy john he's recovering from that but um could be a huge bolster part to our bullpen when he comes back Anthony Volp and a Ryan Mountcastle who actually put together a pretty solid year. Yeah. So yeah, like I said, I like those. I like the chromes. They're cool looking. Cool cards. Once again, though, we have plenty of new cards to be able to add to our collection. Um, start really building up a collection. Like I said, any like those are all sports people.